Welcome back to Replay, everyone. Andrew Reiner here. Today we're playing Rage from id Software and Bethesda Softworks. This came out on October 4th, 2011. Uh, we're playing the PlayStation 3 version, also on 360 and PC. We've got Jeff Cork here. Hello. Serial Vasquez. Hello. And Leo Vader. Thank you. Uh, what'd you guys think of this game? Jeff? It what's had your hot a take? Nice frame rate and mega textures, and it was fun. I adored it up until the ending. I thought one of the worst endings of all time in gaming. Really? Hands down. I don't remember the ending, but I do remember enjoying most of it. I, I think I agree with a lot of people's uh, complaints that it was kind of a little repetitive, a little bland looking in some of the environments, but it, it had a really good frame rate and mega textures and <laughs> yeah, it looked really exactly. nice. Id Tech 5. Yeah. The last game uh, John Carmack released uh, under Bethesda. Look at this. I'm looking at it. Directed by Tim Willits, who's from Minnesota. That's where we're based. Mm -hmm. He was Goldie the Gopher for the Minnesota Gophers. That's I'm not making that up. That experience inspired yeah. video game rage. Did he? What did he bring to that character? Did he? Did you ever talk to him about that? Uh, the backflip that ends in the handstand. Really? Yep. He can do that? Yep. That was Tim Willits. Wow. And the head stayed on. That's it the did. important yeah, part. Yeah, that's that's what everybody was impressed with. Like, it wasn't even just resting on the ground. Like, he yeah. fastened that thing in. That's good. Frame rate on that backflip, also very good. Yep. Man, they're really going for drama here, aren't they? Mm-hmm. This reminds me of the new trailer, the new live-action trailer for Rage Two. Mm. Yeah. Space stuff. Can you just play some punk rock music over this? And yeah, I, and I think you nail it. This was, a, I feel like, at the tail end of like the modern warfare, gears of war sort of trend of like we we want to make we want to take our world very seriously, and we want to make this sci-fi sort of post-apocalyptic thing very intense, uh, which I feel like was most of the 360 PS3 era. Yeah, yeah. the color brown. Yeah, it was also everywhere. Very popular. It's also tan. Come on. True. Shades of gold sometimes. Mm -hmm. Ochre. Texture popping. You ever do like uh, laser tag in the mall? Or yeah. at, at some like uh, arcade mm -hmm. where they have like the big story arc before you go in and play? Yeah, the little they have, like the calibration sequence. Yeah. This reminds me of that. Oh. Isn't that every video game though to some extent where they try to explain the reason why you're doing gameplay basically? Think about it. Yeah, I'm thinking about it. Oh god, guys. Arc system load. Touch those wires. Can you do that? Yeah, just immediately die. Uh, oh no. Mm. It looks like the arc system doesn't work. Oh, one out of 12 ain't bad. <laughs> Is that what you give as joke? A one out of 12? <laughs> exactly. <laughs> How many Bethesda games start with this? The, uh, like you can't bright. handle sunlight? All of them. It's <laughs> mandatory. Rogue Warrior started that way? Yeah. The f too much fucking light. <laughs> so they wanted this to be an open world experience, but it ended up being more like open hubs. Mm -hmm. You yeah. know, they're really, really small. Why did the game <laughs> drove like 10 feet? Whatever. That's right. John Goodman's in this game. That's right. Star power. It ain't safe here. Get in. Do you think he'd rather do Roseanne or Rage 2? <laughs> hey, look at this. He can have both. Call out to Doom. Yeah. In case, isn't there an Easter egg you can play Doom in this one? Oh, let's see if we can get subtitles here. There we go. Check for invites. Yeah, see if anyone's invited you to play Rage with them. <laughs> Yeah, it looks just like John Goodman, too. Mm-hmm. 
So if you're a game designer and you do get John Goodman. Yes. You you make the character look like John Goodman, right? Hmm. Right. Like, how like he's that caliber of a star. Like right? Patrick Stewart's one-to-one -one representation in Oblivion. Yeah, yeah, you need to do. You need he's to. locks. <laughs> you need to pay respects to John Goodman. He's he's a big enough star where you want people to know it's him. Yeah. I feel like you don't necessarily need to like map his likeness, but just make a character that feels like I could see John Goodman's voice coming out of this yeah. guy. Because he's got a very recognizable voice. Probably looking for their buddies. Team, now we both got a problem. Beautiful. This is like Far Cry 2. The opening of Far Cry 2. Now you got space malaria. Yeah. Great. So the whole thing... space church. With the asteroid, it's a little confusing how they kind of set this up, but... An asteroid hit Earth, and that's what created uh, the apocalypse, basically, mm -hmm. right? Like, all life started dying and blah, blah, blah. Hey. Humanity's fighting for survival in these factions. Mm -hmm. This is Route 66. So we're in the kind of your home base here. Vehicles, we're not driving right now, but no. are a huge part of the game. Maybe too much so, mm -hmm. I think a lot of people would say. Yeah. Um, the racing was not uh, the most popular aspect, but again, you see that in Rage 2. I know a lot of people were saying that it looks like they're doing Borderlands more than, than Rage. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I think that's the marketing. Yeah. Uh, Come on, this way. I don't want to say like they're they're being uh, untrue to what the game is. We'll have to wait and see. Mm -hmm. But all the footage made it look like more Rage just on a larger scale. Yeah. Do you think... Vehicles will play a larger role oh. or a yes. lesser? Okay. You think? I think just for transportation, right? Like travel? Mm -hmm. I put a mm -hmm. lot at risk what do you think is the best implementation Not of vehicles life, in a non-racing game? Everyone here. I mean, Grand Theft Auto, right? GTA. Yeah. I think the driving model was started off a little rough, but I think it's gotten better. We were talking about sleeping dogs yesterday. That had really good oh, cars. Yeah. Yeah. Combat. To Head to where those bandits live and wipe them out, plain and simple. No one walks out alive, except you. You can use one of my ATVs in the garage, and that pistol, and the supplies on the table. Oh, oh jeez. I like come that it tells you you can use those supplies on the table, but when you go to highlight them, it says that you can't take them. <laughs> one more thing. Those bandits shouldn't be too hard to take down. Not for you. I hear there's something special about you ARC people. Guy he doesn't stop talking. I guess if you get John Goodman for a day, yes, exactly. You know, give him as much dialogue as possible. I want this. We need you to read every word in the dictionary, mm -hmm. John. What is the celebrity cameo from a Bethesda published game that has lasted the longest in the story? What was that? Mm. Was it, uh, I mean, uh, Liam Neeson. Fallout uh, Three. The main protagonist in Wet was played by. Uh, I don't want. Zoe Deschanel, is that right? Are you kidding? Am I wrong? Leo, you got to look that up. No, she was... New girl herself? No, 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 not her. Uh, <laughs> it was someone else. It was... She was in Buffy. Oh, Sarah Michelle Gellar? No, it was... She was like Allison one of the Allison Hannigan? No. Ah. Oh, she did, she did. Faith, uh, Faith, five by five. Spike. <laughs> yeah, that's right. All right, we're uh, on our way. I need to look that up. I didn't, It's going to tear me apart. I'm she looking did. it up. Okay. Ruby was the character's name. Right. Ruby with an I. We all remember that. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. She was played by a guitar solo, as it turns <laughs> out. <laughs> huh. Ah, oh, this is She's awesome. the first Vocaloid. Eliza Dushku. That's what I was. That's what I was thinking of. Did she play Faith in Buffy? She was the Dollhouse, right? She yes. was the Dollhouse. Yeah. All right. Are you having a good time right now? So she, I am. Ah, this is look at those cool statues. Oh right, she was was she who like replaced Buffy when Buffy was spoilers. <laughs> That's yeah. right, Buffy. She was Buffy slayer, spoiled right? the plot of Buffy and was removed. I think yeah. this Buffy show has too much Buffy. Can we, can we push <laughs> her back a little bit? Stanley mailbox. Man, this just feels good. 
She was also the voice of Yumi Sawamura in Yakuza 2005. Hmm. For PS2. Her most memorable role. Yeah. Is that all she does now is bit roles in video games? What's the last thing she did? The Saint. A TV movie. Okay. She was also BB-8 in Star Wars. Oh. Hmm. Hmm. Work on the sticks? Yeah. No, in the ball. In the ball. Oh, my (laughs) Lord. She's She's... you know, larger on She's screen. very small. Yeah. 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 That effect was practical, but they shrunk it down. <laughs> it's a human in a ball. Look at this. I like that mission objective. Eliminate every bandit you find. Loot bodies. Yep. There's this very present green tint to all the uh, interiors here. Yeah, Leo, is the RGB calibrated? No, I remember this being a part of this okay, game. Jump. What? But I feel like this was some sort of attempt to make hmm, it realistic. Because sometimes if you read outside in the daylight and then you come in, everything does have a weird green tint to it. Or that might just be me. I might just have weird eyes. you feeling eyes. okay, buddy? Look at this. I'm looking. It's like Fortnite. That's right. 100 people in that. Wow. There should have been a secret here. Yeah. <laughs> The key card or something. <laughs> so, someone on, got the Ed. memo about like make sp- uh, spokes that you know branch off into different hallways, but forgot to put the collectibles in. Yep. <laughs> oh, it's the satisfaction of finding a hallway. It's <laughs> <laughs> the real reward. Where did I get some huffer? What was that? An aerosol can. Junk. It was a small object. I think is what it was categorized as. I want to shoot. Let's quell the threat. Why don't we? Press X to radio. That was the other thing I remember about Rage was that you'd have sort of Skyrim-esque dungeons where you'd basically start a level and at the end of it you'd loop back around to the beginning of the level and Mm -hmm. and then you just got out the same way you came in. Okay, so one of the most impressive things of this game is how enemies react to getting shot. Look at it. That one died. (laughs) <laughs> oh, a little, but surreal, they all react a differently. Pelvic twist at <laughs> okay. the end when you looted them. That was nice. Uh, but they Some can like start dancing. Next they can like bounce off walls yeah. mm-hmm. and keep running. It's really cool. I remember being really impressed by that. Uh, again, I gave this a nine out of ten. See how right I was. <laughs> In my mind, I definitely remember the death animations as like better than anything else has mm-hmm. been in since life. Then, yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. The peak of hum- the human experience. <laughs> I went so and saw people die after this game came out, and it's just not realistic enough. Yeah. You just fell over? You just fell right <laughs> on the ground? Yeah. Really, dude? One thing I'll say about Bethesda games that they get absolutely right is just the allure of looting. Like, you just want to pick everything up in their games, and they always mm-hmm. have crap everywhere. What do you think this is? So do you crap. think they told that to Id, and like... Hey, you got to put a bunch of crap for people to pick up. Yeah. Oh, thing. definitely. Like, what that's are what our we're core pillars? A bunch of crap. Company. If that hallway doesn't have a pickup in it, you're fired. And then they fired him, so he couldn't put anything in the hallway. So that hallway didn't remain. You see empty. that? Yeah, like it's a little flip. Well, he interacted <laughs> with the environment. Yeah, and there was this. He had like the staggered walk after you mm-hmm. shot him the first time. That's uh, yeah. You never. The see tech that. behind rage. No Pretty game's cool. ever done that again. Yeah. You remember the first time you shot a guy in the leg in a video game and they, like, limped? That was cool. Yeah. Now it just happens all the time. Or when you shoot them off a balcony and they flip off the front of it? Yeah. (laughs) Yeah, you shoot them when they're up high and they don't know where to go. You know, they're kind of stumbling back and forth, and then they decide to go forward off the railing. Do you think we will be as visually impressed by Rage 2? Do you think it'll be a similar effect of, like, wow, I can't believe they did this on a console? I hope so. Yeah, some of the some of this stuff is worth keeping. Like, the, yeah, these enemies. Oh man, are... if you don't headshot them, look out. Okay, here you go, Jeff. Ready? Yep. <laughs> <laughs> All right, this Should way or this way? Up yes. or around? Which way? How up. many weeks before launch do you think they up. decided to animate that? Is when you loot them, they have to move a little bit. Just enough. Yeah, we have to make the looting realistic, guys. That fire looks good too. Thank you. This is back the way you came, right? Yeah. Damn it, Jeff. Hey. Is there a mini map? No. There was Hello. in the overworld, but yeah. not here. Maybe it's so mini we can't perceive it. <laughs> it's oh, a man. micro map. What do you think the lore behind this guy is? What a 
He's Weird hotel. He's a man who loves the boots. <laughs> yeah, I, I don't want to wake up in the morning and look out and see this guy. That's the guy who made my hotel. That's uh -oh. exactly what I want to see. Oh, you just got far cried. <laughs> oh, I really did, actually. You're just... Game over. Do you know what the definition of rage is? <laughs> Uh, does that sound good? <laughs> what do you think whoa, they do whoa, in there? Whoa. That's where they cut up their meat that they're going to eat? Mm -hmm. good. Oh, God. I like my prey to low Why did you keep that guy around after you stabbed him? This will hurt. Oh! You were joking about getting Far Cry. Oh, I forgot oh. about this crap. Uh, you need Why did I give this a nine? <laughs> Oh my god. What am I doing now? I, I oh, just know okay. that I don't want to do it. <laughs> this is really dumb. Get ready. Uh, rage! Uh, oh, rage. okay, I get it. My heart works! Ta-da! That's a great defense mechanism. All right, Jeff. This to really. This is for you. Oh. 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 oh, wow. Okay. Manual saves. Gentlemen, what do you think of that? I nice. like them. I hope Rage 2 has the thing that Dishonored had where you could you could basically pause and then hold, I think, R2 to save immediately like it had like a quick save quick load system in a console game which was pretty novel i think when oh it yeah out. yeah the new fallout had it quick save and yeah. that was something that uh when i went and visited uh bethesda gameworks todd howard said took longer than he even wanted to admit right. like that took a long time to implement for fallout 4 you mean yes Uh. Okay, I hear exciting music. So you know something exciting is happening. Oh. What's the benefit of... I hope you get the boomerang. You do. Oh, I mean like in this video. Oh. I, I think so I played too. most of this game. Why I remember you stop, liking, Leo? I think I beat it. I don't remember the ending at all. I would like to hear what the bad ending is. Yeah. Can you just whisper it in our ears right, right now? Uh, we could show the ending, I guess, right? Oh. If we Maybe. tag it appropriately. There's just a huge We don't want to end up like Sarah here. Michelle Geller. Yeah, one after another, like a clown car. Is the ending a cliffhanger? Ah, boy, I don't remember exactly mm. what they set up, but I know it was just like the worst. So part. The, yeah, the most unfulfilling conclusion to a game. I, mean, I think it was like a CG sequence. Yeah, I, I want to say they oh, actually like said space or something. I don't Rage remember. Rage Two 2018 mm. at the end of this game. <laughs> Rage Whether you like will it or return. not. <laughs> Does this game explain its title? I mean, not that it really needs to. It's pretty self The enemies are mad at you. You just get so mad. <laughs> I guess it, it's an, one in the long line of id games with just single word titles that don't... Yeah. ...aren't really mentioned too much. There's, no, it, there's no real quaking or quakers in Quake. <laughs> <laughs> that would be great if that's the big reveal. <laughs> it's all about quakers. Do they call themselves that? Fans? You've got a quake con, haven't you? You, you yeah. didn't ask that question? No. Do you guys refer to I'll, I'll, I'll make a shirt that says I'm a Quaker. I'm a Quaker? With the with Quake the, with logo. With the symbol, yeah, yeah. And everybody's going to want it. Yep. I'm going to go viral. You Photoshop sort of the uh, the Quaker Ooh. oatmeal mm -hmm. logo to look like it's for Quake. The game Quake. Sorry. I love exploring. But I'm not finding a lot. Wow! Oh, and did a kick. 
I like that his instinct when faced with someone with a gun was kick him. Yep. <laughs> Big spinning kick. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I'll definitely have time to do my my spinning back kick. I want to hit a guy so he goes on the wall. Ooh, I, you need I saw his eyeball that. fall off. Really? Oh. Yeah. This came on Can two I? discs on Xbox, oh. right? Are they killing cows in here, oh, did too? it? Yeah, I think so. Huh. Or horses? It was so big. Can, can handle the mega textures. I'm trying to figure out where I'm supposed to aim on this thing. Yeah. They usually have like a like a sharp edge to yeah. look through, but this is it was like a rounded middle. Thanks a lot, John Goodman. <laughs> it's all his fault. Uh yeah, this holds up really well. It feels great. Mm -hmm. You guys want to check it out. Like And this is the era where like most shooter controls it just feels like a well-worn glove, right? Mm -hmm. Like, you know exactly what button's going to do what. I'm so glad they figured that out. Most. And then when you get the games where it's like, uh, reload's not where mm -hmm. you want it to be. Or, or you know, like in an Something open like world Overwatch. games when it's not yeah, yeah. triangle to enter a car. Yeah. It's like, who messed oh, this yeah. up? God, I hate that. X? Don't make it X. Get out of here. You can get in the car. Yeah. How long is it? Because I always get sort of this it's pretty long. nagging feeling of play, replaying old games whenever the sequel's announced, but I just don't have the time. I remember it being about 20, 20 30 hours? Yeah. yeah pretty there's long. some depth to it. Did that guy just move on with his new life? <laughs> I, I think <laughs> he did. Guy, oh. He's shot dead the last 40 people he's encountered. I'm not going to be the one. Nope. Should throw some grenades, shouldn't I? He Absolutely. Grenades. Yep. Let's see. What are what button would grenades be? Be right bumper, right? Uh. What? What? Equip fist. Yeah. Hmm. <laughs> oh, Maybe there we go. Oh. Wait. Okay. He grenades. Okay, so it's grenades for him. Grenades are on <laughs> right on the D-pad to select it. Yep. Uh, okay. Okay, I'm cooking it. Oh! Nice. Wow. Okay, that's kind of wonky. Those guys jibbed. They didn't even get a chance to say grenade. <laughs> Potato masher. Oh, he's still up. That's really cool. He's trying to crawl back into cover. Mm. He's trying to use his nano trites. <laughs> Man, this game's better than any shooter that has come after it. Really? We all really? agree to that, right? Yeah. I, in a heartbeat. I, I'm distancing myself from this. This game defined a decade. Yeah. <laughs> Where was this in our top 300? I don't think it even. 25, top 25, right? I Is it like the one to two yeah. range, somewhere in there? The, yeah. alter, the the name of the game in Japan was uh, The Legend of Zelda: Link to the Past. I think it was. Right. Oh. Huh. I like that music too. Well, it's gone. Yeah. Now we just have the like a yak yep. sound. Mm. Mm. So many. All right, here we go. You guys ready? I'm ready for a zip line. We all like this zip I've lines. See. Top ten list of the future for the website. Yeah. Top ten zip lines. Yeah. Who just moves the zip line back? Games up? with zip lines in them, or just specific zip lines? The best zip lines. Okay. The ones we find the most entertaining. Okay. That was okay. Is it Bioshock Infinite? It would be number one, right? Yeah, because you can make your own. Yeah. You can make your own zip lines. Yeah. All right, hey, we you did it. A trophy. Ghostbuster? What? He killed the ghost gang. Mm hmm. Rage makes me feel good. We got to stop with the, the goofy achievements. We needed I a committee so. to get together yep. to hold the industry accountable. 100%. <laughs> enough is enough. Please Nothing like a really seriously. dramatic moment in a game and mm -hmm. then a, a jokey punny achievement or yeah, trophy. That's going to leave a mark. You're like, oh, I just watched my dad get <laughs> headshotted. <laughs> <laughs> or daddy I can, issues. I can or has dead dad. 
Yeah, you, you can tell that those are written when everyone working on the game completely resents everything about the game. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Do you think the next Skyrim or the next Elder Scrolls has a arrow to the knee trophy joke in it? Yes. Yeah. Okay. What would you get it for? Shooting a guy in the knee with an arrow. Yeah. <laughs> that's it, just that. It's that, that simple. simple. It's that easy, folks. <laughs> it's that easy. Well, no, they're going to take it to the next level. The next level? And it'll be shoot a hundred guys in um, to get the trophy. And the trophy's points. like, that's a lot of people who aren't adventurers anymore. <laughs> like, unlike you. Uh, Thanks for playing out. our game. It's oh. not there. How many trophies are there that are exactly that? Thank you for playing our game. <laughs> <laughs> oh, isn't there something for hitting these? Anyone that's like open the main menu for the first time. Yeah. It's basically a thanks for Thank playing you. our game. Yeah. Thanks for buying. Can't delete this off your profile anymore. <laughs> How many times when you look at the main menu and it has credits have you clicked on that? <laughs> exactly one time. I don't remember which game it was. But then you immediately... Oh, that's the credits button. Never mind. Back <laughs> yeah. out. Oh, spoilers. Okay, so we're looking for Halleck. Is this Halleck? It's gotta be. Let me Lose. guess. You wanna know? No. <laughs> Damn bandits. I think she's gonna give you the boomerang. Not on our watch. <laughs> Halleck! Where are ya? Halleck! Halleck! Check the uh, mini map. Halleck! Oh, I see you've moved to the other side of the counter. We're all a little safer because of that. <laughs> I got scared of it. A living world. <laughs> He's got I his like own routine. <laughs> One side of the uh, counter to oh, the next. Oh, is he vaping? Maybe. Listen, the settlement was attacked while you were gone. Bunch of bandits we've never seen before. He has a good, unique voice, doesn't he? Came for the yeah. He does. We have some good I would love to heard, read or listen to an audiobook supplies. narrated by John Goodman. I'm gonna Which one? Help again. Which John Goodman? Well, it's the one <laughs> we're talking to. <laughs> Which book? Just oh, I don't know. Way, Something non-fiction, historical. They tend to stick to um, green eggs and ham. Green, <laughs> green eggs and ham. And they have what we need. Just give this letter to Richter. He'll know what to do. <laughs> Why are you backing away? <laughs> <laughs> I'll make sure our mechanic in town sets you up with your own buggy. There's, what is that in his hand? I think it's a telescope. Thank you. There's this very, like, you go, make sure you exaggerated you feel to the Ammo, to these character sticks, animations of just, mm -hmm. like, we start not, from, we start at point A and then very the quickly move to point B and then just kind of move our hands a little bit around between those. It's hard, kind of hard to explain because I'm not, like, an animation major, but... Yeah. It definitely stands out to me. Right under the old sign up front is where Halleck is. This is the old sign? There we go. Welcome, stranger. Name's Halleck, and it's a pleasure meeting you. Blast him! <laughs> yep, do it. Got See what happens. Here to keep you alive Can't, won't let you. What if you're farther away? Sometimes. And, uh, Throw a he grenade. <laughs> Man, he just did not react at all here. Warning shot. Oh, well, I'm done. Can't. Hello, stranger, again. I buy and sell everything that you need in these parts. Bed rolls, cans of beans. <laughs> what do you need, pal? Uh, let's see. What is this? He's got a Monocular. reassuring look to him. He's got a what? A reassuring look. Mm -hmm. <laughs> yes, I will definitely sell you things. And then we could sell our junk. You can trust my prices. But none of this is junk. Do you think... Wait, what? Are grenades actually $4 in real life, do you think? Is this junk? Hmm... Beer bottles. Jeff Cork, what would you, what would you pay for yeah. one grenade? One grenade? What are the rules that go with this grenade? They, it's Is a, this a grenade? I can will I get in trouble for having it? Uh, let's say okay. let's say no. You're just gonna buy this grenade just to have around for home defense. Yeah, home defense. Four dollars and one cent. Four dollars and yep. one cent. Oh, so you're getting a deal in rage. Yep. You gotta protect your family. Exactly. <laughs> home defense grenade. I keep it <laughs> under my pillow. <laughs> I'll make a deal with you. you, prove you Every night is fun because I unpin, I unpin it, and then pin it when I wake up. So in case I'm, I'm ever attacked in my sleep. Yep. 
Oh, he's taking with me. I got the wing sticks. You ever eat wing sticks? Are those just chicken wings? Yeah, it's a Buffalo. Buffalo. Pizza Hut. Whoops. <laughs> That's what the hut calls them. Yeah. You can get a wing stick at Wing Street. Buffalo You're a natural. Wild wing sticks. What are you catching it with? You just got Ow! your face. <laughs> You're right in your teeth. Ow! Acha cha. Just lodging it in your skin. <laughs> There's no. That is an oversight. Yeah, you'd think with all the animations in this game, one of them would be I caught the uh, the wing stick. I'd be nervous. Talk to Halleck and he can set you up. They must have had a much more sophisticated version of that, and that mission was supposed to be like maybe the catching of it, but they just pulled it out because that was like. It's like shooting a gun, and they yeah. had to do that as like a mini game. Well, you are really, really good runner and the best. So. And the best. That's true. Uh, so how do I equip this? So that's just a use, an item use. Let's see. There it is. Okay. Yeah. Also, maybe it doesn't come back every time in yeah. the okay. wild. Let's see. I probably would have gotten sick of this game like five times faster if there weren't wing sticks in it. That's. I feel like that's mm -hmm. all I did was try and throw wing sticks at people. Oh, was I supposed to get a buggy? Oh, well. It's fine. When it when you see the tires, like, they look like they're not spinning because they're spinning so fast in video mm -hmm. games, mm -hmm. is looks that like a bug. in effect they're... Like, oh. are they making it so they're not spinning so it looks like they're going fast? Or, or are they really going that fast? That's just, a like, a genuine optical thing that your eyes do? Or is it yeah. just like, hey, we're trying to replicate that, that exact mm -hmm. optical thing? That's my thing? exact question. Yeah. How do I get my gun I, I, back? I, I, I'm willing to bet that it's an effect they do. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Uh, I also like. Yeah, I also like it when when you see cars driving on the highway or something, and it kind of looks like I they're my gun? spinning backwards because no. they're spinning so fast. Yeah. There. I like oh, the way God. eyes work. Eyes are crap out of me. Eyes are cool. Yeah. Got a lot of work to do here, pal. If you need something, come by later. <laughs> Tightening the license plate. <laughs> Looking for Richter. He's up there. You know, you can just buy the sticker. You don't have to change the plates out every time. <laughs> exactly. I wear this all the time. <laughs> I go to sleep with this thing. It smells like my mouth in here. <laughs> Whenever I have minty things, it's just all day with the mint. I see you've met my brother, Ramos Outrigger. Go on. She's just up there. You're the note, but when you're done, come back here. I may have something that'll interest you. He has something. Pretty good animation. Yeah. It's got a style to it. Kind of cartoony. She's the only one who can see the world in 3D. Well, the Oracle. <laughs> Some of these things I'll need to track down, but you know the way it works here. We help you. You help Can you actually make that out? Oh, crap. Uh -oh. I threw her today. <laughs> Ma'am, I'm sorry. <laughs> nah, she's fine. Okay, you were... So while I gather your supplies, how about you go look for it? I like the image of you, of her talking to you while you're using your magnifying glass to read a note that's right next to you. <laughs> it won't let me look, use it on her. It stops it. That's what's happening. Oh, they're embarrassed. Like I'm looking, 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 looking. <laughs> that's rude. <laughs> yeah. It's too much. Shouldn't be doing that. Couldn't help but notice, stranger, that gun you're carrying isn't much of anything. Could set you up with some real fire problems. Yes! Help us out here and I'll give you a real weapon. You could just give it to me now? Yeah, yeah the way I know how to talk to people is by blocking their way until they talk to me. <laughs> I'm probably just out of alignment. You get it fixed for me. I'll give you a shotgun. Combat Thanks shotgun. This should be an easy job. I got wing sticks. Yeah. This holds up really well. They should re-release this. I think people would dig it. Any chance Rage 2 comes with Rage 1? Oh, man, that'd be awesome. Is Rage 1 backwards compatible on Xbox One? Oh, could we look that up? I can look that up. Be a deer and look that up. Thank you. I remember trying to run the PC version of Rage a few years back, and I don't... I think there was some issue with it, with my computer, that it didn't didn't really work with it. didn't have enough hard drive space. Yeah. Hope they solved that. 
Yeah, solve my hard drive space <laughs> issue, id. It is backwards compatible, and you can buy it for fifteen dollars on the. There you go. Oh, that's, that's what start. you should do. Yeah, you'll get that free with Rage Two. Pre-order Rage Two and get. The first well, you get first Rage free. Two free if you buy. <laughs> right. Oh, yeah. special edition Guarantee. of Rage One. Says Pete Hines. All I want in the world is for Xbox 360 backwards compatibility to come to Windows 10. Yeah. Then you would have no reason to own an Xbox. <laughs> right. Oh, bad guys. Wrong button. Wing sticks, baby. Uh, Hit them with the where stick. are my bandages? There. Am I okay? I think you're okay. just fine. Do you think it would be feasible for Microsoft to have a way for your computer ready to read Xbox 360 discs? Oh. I have no idea. Eat ooh. Even even just to recognize, hey, this is Rage. We're going to let you play Rage now because you have the disc in there. Like it basically does on there. I'm sure technologically right. there's a solution. Yeah. <laughs> oh. Did he take that off or did he shoot him? him off. Okay. Kind of looked like he... Ooh, man, he's got a good shot. So how is this working? You've, you're have you holding up a monocular while <laughs> aiming yep. a he's, pistol he's got, that's he's accurate. Got two real good hands. Uh, this looks dangerous. Loot cave. A bucket? Look, the loot. Oh, don't <laughs> look up. You're going to see a human butt. <laughs> That'd be amazing. <laughs> Is this is that what this is, guys? Yeah. What's this? Poop flower. Oh, that doesn't sound right. It's a fun Easter egg. Yeah. Yeah. It's how they poop in this Full world. Of toilet fans. Someone over yonder. <laughs> well, he can't give you that combat shotgun fast enough. <laughs> Grabbed him by the chicken nuggets. I prefer a non-combat shotgun. Yeah? Yeah. Just one for you know, day-to-day -day use. Collector's <laughs> shotgun. Yeah, just to like tactically breach soft walls in my house to <laughs> get around faster. Alright, I got the wing stick. I'm gonna throw it at the next guy I see. If there is anyone, jeez. Here he is. Where? I don't know. I like the architecture too. It's got a style. Do you know? They're big fans of the movie. Yeah. I'll hit him with the stick. Wing stick that. <laughs> <laughs> Can he pick it up again? Or does no, it's it shattered? Oh yeah! Look at that. <laughs> Single-use wing stick. Oh no. That guy explode? Yeah, you hit him with a wing stick right I know, there. but do you think it'd just stick in his back or something? No. Here we go. This is a horror game. Mm -hmm. It is kind of scary. You just glide up there, no hands. I should have called it fear. Hmm. No, no. No, it's not an acronym. It's just right. Just the name fear. What's this? What did I do? Activated the radio tower. Great job. Thank you. Do you think they're bringing Rage back? Because like they would have made a new IP, but they're just kind of out of one word names that are catchy and mm -hmm. not taken. Yeah, yeah, what's another one they could use? Well, they act not take Activision it. took gun, so that... Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, Hatred's taken. Black is taken. Halo. Halo <laughs> is taken. Fuse um, is taken. Haven't seen anyone talk about Prey for a long time. Yeah. What if they also called this <laughs> Prey? God, even Dishonored is just one. Yeah. I think it's oh, letter okay. of the law, not spirit of the law. I think you want one syllable word. Oh, he's your friend. That's okay. That was my mission. That kind of sucked. <laughs> that mission sucked, dude. 
Oh, that's all I wanted. I went and did I a d- job for you. It was not fun. <laughs> I didn't wake up from cryo sleep to do boring <laughs> sh- for you. Flip of the switch. We usually don't get them this far out. You did good though. See Janice. Just waiting to hear what you found. What? What is this? It's a Wh- shotgun. <laughs> what did I find? Nothing. This looks perfect for combat. <laughs> yeah, I need to hold it a little longer though. I knew something was wrong. Uh. But the I silent protagonist. He gets all the info out there right away. <laughs> yep. a second. But thank you for looking. And here is what you need, as well as the plans to make your own healing bandages. Just look for the things so listed. So you need what a bandage. They, they will help you whenever you are hurt. To make those. Thank you again. And good luck. So in the new game, you're playing as someone named Walker, right? Who? What are these? Bandages. Oh, build. Cool. Crafting. So you play as someone as Walker. He's can use like kind of a nanotechnology to enhance his abilities, give him like force push stuff like that. Is that all you want? Is just kind of faceless action from Rage, just more powers, or would you want them to take the time to develop the character? Oh, yeah, I don't care. You know what I mean? Like, (laughs) forgot my vehicle. I feel like. The best version of Rage 2 that I would want to play would be a nice podcast game. Yes. Yeah. Where it's very fun, but I can just tune out the story and just listen to whatever I'll, whatever is going on in the world. Yeah. The beginning of the game, they really kind of tried to build it up like, this guy's important. He's in yeah. space for some reason. Mm-hmm. Who is he? Yeah, he's obviously very skilled, but you just it ends up just being a faceless shooter, right? Yeah. The plot in Rage is not necessarily... The, the draw as much as I lo- as much as the world looks pretty nice it's uh, not really the, the whys and hows aren't really that important I'm starting to think yeah. I made a good decision by saving you that's a microaggression you used to there <laughs> look at that forehead detail look at that now go talk with DR about that buggy the Santa Monica Let's team actually looked at Dan Heigar's forehead when, you know, modeling Kratos's or God of War. Yeah, they motion captured Dan Hagar from this game. <laughs> We've never motion captured someone else's model, but we decided this would be a good time to try. Made a hologram of Dan Hagar. <laughs> Dan said you were taking that old buggy off my hands. Mm-hmm. Truth is, not a bad vehicle, but Mm-mm. see, it needs work and parts. The work I can do, but the parts you're gonna need to get. Johan, back at the Outrigger settlement, should be able to help. Sound good? Okay. Sounds great. See you back here can I have this? Parts. Also, like I also like a good guy who know is confident enough in his name to put it on his clothes. Mm-hmm. Uh, I can't take it yet. What a tease, Bethesda. Hey, Save making for games. Too. This vehicle will return. <laughs> Man, we've already been playing this 43 minutes. Yeah. Yeah. We just Let's titled this video the up. first hour of Rage <laughs> 1. <laughs> of Rage 2. It's prequel, Rage 1. <laughs> well, now, since we all agree this is the best shooter of this generation, uh, yeah. I want to show you what number 2 is. Okay. Jeff, I think you're going to love what we're going to take a look at. I would like to take a look at that and love it. All right. That's it for Rage. Definitely go check it out. As you can see, it holds up pretty well. Uh, If you didn't like the game, let us know in the comments, and uh, I will be sure to write you back and tell you that you're wrong. Let's move on to the next game. All right. Here we are. Raven Squad. Mm -hmm. Jeff Cork, you saw me play some of this when I reviewed it back in the day. It's true. Gave it a... 10 out of 10. Yeah, minus, really? minus 8. Mm. I remember you were in, unable to shoot through a chain link fence. Yeah, or... Yeah, I think there was just a guy sitting like over a little like anthill, mm-hmm. and I, there was like a big collision box around it, and I couldn't shoot through it. Yeah. What was the logic behind putting math in the score? Just, oh, people to use their brains. Yeah. Is it just like a Canadian law thing where you have to put a skill test in the magazine? It to, was a so sneaky way it? of getting our magazine in the classroom. Oh, okay. Mm-hmm. Did not work. No. At all. We weren't widely Four adopted. Days before Christmas. Oh, and again, guys. we were rotting in a goddamn jungle. Who knows where? This job is no big deal. We only <laughs> have to eliminate a few low-life drug dealers. Three of us are more than enough. We usually take jobs on a much bigger scale. 
This one is some sort of favor to a friend in the NSA. <laughs> I hope we finish it fast, as I want to spend this Christmas in Vegas. I like the weird conflict of like, here's this Winston Churchill quote. Also, <laughs> listen to this guy talk about whatever for a minute. <laughs> Leo, you'll be interested to know this is a Rainbow Six Vegas prequel, unofficially. Oh, wow. wow. Yeah. I really want to go to Vegas for another <laughs> operation I'm doing. <laughs> I'm Rainbow Five. I have five friends. That line in uh, Rainbow Six Vegas. Is that We're a real footage? Raven squad. Is that CG or is that in-game graphics or is that an actual helicopter? Like? They, they found an actual helicopter with octagonal wheels. Yeah. They motion captured it too. Wow. <laughs> who Who did this? Who made this? Who did this, fam? <laughs> <laughs> Don't credit there. Uh, no, seriously, who 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 made who developed this? Atomic something. Okay. It just said it on screen. Mm. I remember one word. I remember that developer having made other games. Clearly. Oh. Okay, guys. This For the trivia game. hounds out so there. Yeah. The this developer has also is made other games. Good. Now check your gear and get Nobody ready. said anything. Good. Keep your mouth shut. The druggies in the village has some listening devices in the jungle. You know what? Everyone, arc your back a little okay, bit. Let's move, people. You gonna put that down? No. You're up. See you later. Kanye West's helicopter. Just looks so good. Wait, look at that guy again. Okay. Do you take back what you said about Rage being the best shooter of the generation? You know, just the. Fluidity of movement here. Mm -hmm. you go, yeah, I think I think this has it beat. Mega textures have nothing on these. These are textures. These are mondo textures. Roger. <laughs> Jeez, he's loud. Like I like your code names here: Paladin, Thor, and Oso. Just two very knightly things, and then a bear in Spanish. Whoa. <laughs> okay. You don't need to brag. <laughs> Do I gotta stay low this whole time? For something. Or can I get up? You can shoot by pressing retweet. <laughs> <laughs> oh, you guys ready? Whoa. I'm ready. I'm under fire. Whoa, what? <laughs> they were doing stealth ops on you. Oh man, it oh, the sound design. You gave him a chance to run. It just feels so good. Is this slow motion? Yeah, was that slow mo or just no? It's, that was it's normal. trying to replicate the way warriors, you know, can make snap decisions. Yeah, the adrenaline gets going. Yeah, it's almost as if time slows down to 15 frames a second. Whoa! Look at that tracking. Thank you. Next stop, the armory. Roger. All right, ladies. Time to find some rockets and light this place some up. Good-natured like ribbing, ladies. Hey, uh, Jason. I know you're a programmer on this game, but could you come in and read a couple lines for us? Uh, we really, we really need someone to voice act this whole game. Sure. Roger. <laughs> hey, we're looking for rockets, guys. Keep your eyes. Are my squad mates really ladies? I don't understand. It's <laughs> very. <laughs> it's a very layered, complex. Uh, uh, okay, web they're trying to weave here. Got some toys mm. for you. No need to play nice. Burn them down. <laughs> there's, uh, there's like no pacing to his delivery whatsoever. Just read all the text on this page, please, and then you can have lunch. What? Tactical switches. Yeah, press A to switch to the rocket launcher. I did. Oh, here we go. Oh, okay. sir! <laughs> Whoa! Did you see the size of that? All right. All right, fire the nuke. They must have noticed you by now. Sure, but we need your eyes. Uh, yeah, whatever. Roger, just tell me what you want to know. So, recount the village. Now, you guys are thinking... And murdered everyone in it. This is a really cool first-person shooter, but guess what? Oh, whoa! It's also a really cool real-time strategy game. Exactly. Cursor simulator. Yeah, just go to the end of the I level and yeah. have a move there. Looks like the center of the village. You can expect some. And what do we have? Here? <laughs> Looks like the leader of those goons. He's up on that hill near the center of the village. So you can expect some. What do we have here? <laughs> Over there. 
Yeah. Okay, I've got them. I see a few tangos uphill next to a few crates of ammo. We should pay the boss a visit, don't you think? How do we get there? Well, hmm. there's only one path. How do we get take, there? But it's blocked by some crates. Make your way through, but make it quick. They are starting to pull themselves together. We have to cut through. Oso, find some grenades. We need them. Could we just walk over? Well, them? Yeah. <laughs> no. They're, they're not insurmountable. That's a lot they're of just, crates. I could squeeze through. There's also a cliff. Can we blow that up or Let's turn into a up. ramp somehow? So Oso's getting the grenades. I forgot to bring my grenades. <laughs> Watch this. As long as I get home by Christmas for Vegas. <laughs> okay, to throw a frag grenade, move the cursor above the targeted mm -hmm. area. Hold down left trigger and then Hold tap. down what? Tap to the right the left. Out of frags! Oh. Okay. Do you do it? Oh, there it goes. I'm about to be out of frags! <laughs> <laughs> there you go! Yeah. You don't want to have to do that again. Okay, guys, get ready for a firefight. Objective, kill him. <laughs> <laughs> I don't need casualties, so use every cover you can find. Now move! I'm under fire! Should I go FPS, or you just want to see this unfold this way? Fold this, yeah, I mean, it's a, really a player way game, so whatever yeah. you feel is... You know, it's gonna get you the win here. Well, who's dying? Oh wow! What did I say about casualties? Look, I can move the camera around. Tango down. Wow! Move over, saving Private Ryan. One down. Look at this cinematography. I'm having to move in. I'm this confident in our nice. skills. This is like company heroes, basically. Hey guys, you got some extra ammo packs lying next to you. Grab it if you need. So far, so good. Now, clear the rest of the village. Let's do it. Let's get moving. How That's do we approach this? Real brain bender. Hmm. Hmm. Mm hmm. Hmm. Maybe we should just go kill the bad guy. I would use uh, Oso. Oh, he's way up there. Can you let's issue commands to your squad and then just have them follow it while you play in first person? Oh, let's see. Let's move out. So I'm just gonna bring them in. They nice. keep going, I guess. Or no, they did they back up? Well, they did the thing. Yeah. Oh, look at that AI. Cleared them out. AI feels fear. Oh, no, no. Heads up. You're getting reinforcements. <laughs> They're just sliding in. Okay, it's like a little dance routine. Uh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> All right, guys, we just practiced our formation. Let's get after them. We don't need to run for cover as long as we're all together. One med kit can heal your squad. Oh, that's cool. It's a shared communal med kit. If you have full HP, don't even try oh, using no. a med kit. Mm -mm. Your squad is invisible. <laughs> nice shot. <laughs> but you will face one exception. Fair warning. Is How do I call use... foreshadowing? How do I use that? Oh, careful! How Does do it feel... actually look like he's throwing it, or is it out of his hand before the animation happens? Okay, he's throwing it. How do you feel about games that have you equip nice the shot. grenade? before you throw it versus just having it be a button. Seems Trash. like you're leading the jury a little bit there. Let's yeah. Paladin. Okay. Well, just imagine no, I asked like that question in a non-leading way. <laughs> okay. I just want to press the button. Just want to press the button? Yep. Dig in, boys. We're going into overtime. Oh. Let's get moving. 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 So what are you guys thinking of this? It's really good and it's mm. smart. Mm -hmm. I like it. Redefines so much. Star tactical warfare. Starcraft, oh. watch out! Let's get moving. Do you think during development they're just like, you know, if we had a good idea, we just come. f it. Oops. We're done. Let's just ship it. Because it it just feels so unfinished, unpolished. Yeah. Mm -hmm. 
stay calm. Oh. Check his vitals. Maybe the team who built it was really resentful of war. <laughs> oh, they were like trying to do a Spec Ops the Line kind of uh, thing. Oh, yeah. yeah. War isn't fun. But they didn't spell it out. They thought, yeah, we thought yeah. we'd just figure this out. We should be a little more subtle. Mm -hmm. And just make the game bad. <laughs> like how war is bad. Yeah. This game, like war, is hell. You just found the one exception, Ryder. Oh god, he's lost his head. <laughs> oh my! There's no coming back this, from that. The interface in this game looks like a fake game you would see on CSI. Yep. Yeah. Nice shot. Uh, that might be my favorite dialogue in a shooter. They're shooting at me. I mean, yeah, I, I, it's I, like, I think duh. your objective, kill them, I think is, is up there as well. <laughs> I like that they yell though while they're shooting. That's a nice touch. Yeah. Okay, we're here. No. <laughs> what are we supposed to do? One down. Clear them out. Okay, keep defending like that, and they keep the family like out. <laughs> rock and roll. Yeah. What's your favorite rock song, Serial? <laughs> favorite rock song? Yeah. It's a hard question. Thank um, you. <laughs> Flintstones huh. theme. Yeah, the Flintstones theme. Uh, let's think back to my favorite rock album. Rock and roll. Yeah, like you know, rock and roll. Yeah. <laughs> rock and roll. Uh, okay, what's your favorite tango down? Oh, what, what's my favorite tango down? Mm -hmm. Um, mm, I think the first one. Okay. The first Tango Down was like probably that. the best one. I like the one in the Ghost Recon Wildlands. Yeah. Yeah. That's demo. a good one. The demo. Are oh, we going to see that at this year's E3? Another. Our, our company's still going to be doing that. Tango Down? The fake, the squad chatter, ta oh. Tango Down. Mm. Yes. Yeah. How, how many times? But it'll be a, like a Twitch streamer. It's not going to be a developer. Mm. Oh, interesting. Yeah. yeah. That's Raven Squad One. Are you, are you saying we're going to see a live heated gaming they moment on, chance, on one yeah, of these Yeah, that's companies? how you know it's real. Yeah. We need a vac immediately. We, the they need a vac? Make your way uphill. There's a little clearing where the bird can land. Oh my hey, God. Boys. How far? Let's what? Move it, move it, move it. This is a huge mission. Let's get moving. This is a big city. Let's get moving. Can I just go like, just point to the yeah, just yeah, just, just go to the helicopter, see what happens. Just run, just huff it. They're doing good oh, so you can far. See the frames per second. <laughs> Turn on the FPS counter. <laughs> we really want to show you how how well this game is running. <laughs> is this just a way to speed run the game? Yep. Look for our speed run of this game again, at AGDQ. You next are year. invincible during this mission, with one exception. Yeah. Well, I already died once. Yep, yeah, that was the exception. The exception. Now you're back to being invincible. They did it. Christmas time, Las Vegas. Good job, everyone. What were some other yeah, games that did this? Too. And I did Band of Brothers, or what was that base. one? Uh, Paladin, about that. Brothers uh, in Arms. Brothers, Don't yeah. Road to Hill Thirty. Company Heroes yeah. is basically this, but without yeah. the FPS. The outfit? Was that one that had... Like, yeah, yeah, I think so, yeah. Brutal Legend is sort of like this, and then you can switch between two modes, sort Oof. of. Yeah, nobody liked that second mode. I, I enjoyed it, but... What was I, it? Tower I mean, Defense? What was the style? It was like real-time strategy, oh, basically. Yeah, yeah. Oof. I like that it tells you your RTS-FPS ratio. Years after the collapse <laughs> of the financial markets, our world changed. While the more advanced countries managed to handle the situation... Life in third world countries became even harder, even more unsafe. Is this like post-apocalyptic? What's going on here? Kingdoms and fought against each other for what they thought. Oh no, man, this is real. This the is a real apocalypse. These conflicts. Brazil was an exception. All right, whatever. <laughs> Don't interrupt me, please. I'm trying to tell you what you're supposed to do here. Whoa. <laughs> That's the cutscene. They don't want to show any faces, right? So we're gonna track this thing by the numbers. Find <laughs> that plane, 
find the package yep. and run whatever you do don't pan up to the faces look at these guns fast, instead people. uh oh i've got a poker match in vegas in 2 days <laughs> I don't want to talk about it all the time, but <laughs> you've twisted my arms, guys. <laughs> and also, I hope I don't have to remind you I've got a poker game coming up. Might do a buffet, see a show. Thank you for following my order, too, to never look at me while I'm talking. <laughs> Real-time parachuting, is that on the back of the box? This is like the opening to Metal Gear Solid 3. <laughs> It really is. You owe me a beer. <laughs> Take off your Raiden mask. <laughs> and what are we Let's doing? See. Are we landing right now, or is this, this the camera? This is 007. The camera was way <laughs> higher, though. <laughs> oh, there's the face. The ah! Oh, boy. <laughs> this little field trip was the worst of bad ideas. <laughs> Come in, Paladin. Repeat. Paladin, do you read? I hear you, OC. Right through the throbbing in my skull. Do you have any contact with the others? Negative. You've landed outside the satellite's field of view. I can barely reach you with the oxalate hmm? gum. Magnificent. <laughs> okay, I'll try to find the others and head toward the drop-off point. Copy that. Be careful. Take it easy. All I can hear is some crazy ocelots. Is Metal Gear. Paladin. Yes, your yeah. ocelots. Yeah, shoot. Yeah, to this fight the Paladin ocelot unit. Talking. Paladin, I landed in the soup, sir. Right inside an enemy control. I could really use some support here, sir. I'm in the soup, sir. <laughs> we know. We, we, <laughs> we know. We how know. much more clear I have to be about this. <laughs> Do you know where I'm the soup, soup is? <laughs> They're shooting at me! I was about to see the Blessed Mother. Oh, thanks, Paladin. O.C., tell me you got a drop on the Over. He's ahead of oh, okay, O.C., I thought he was calling him Oso. O.C. like his <laughs> pet name for him. I, it, <laughs> Oso is already a nickname. You don't need to give me another one. <laughs> Watch out. Enemy soldiers took cover up ahead. Oh, well, I think that's all we need to see of Raven Squad. One down. Uh... Two down. Hopefully this one doesn't come into backwards compatibility, because uh, it is not good. It's not worth the time and effort. Are we going to see a sequel at E3? <laughs> Before Christmas, oh. I hope, because I've got plans <laughs> to go to Vegas. Uh, well, thank you, gentlemen, for joining thank me. Thanks thank again you. for watching. Uh, again, check out Rage. That game is cool. Uh, oh, crap. Don't <laughs> And don't shoot your teammates. Yeah. Uh, Thank you, Leo, yeah, Jeff Cork, Serial. Yeah, we'll yep. see you next time, everyone. Thor, it's time to play with your boomstick.